Well, it's snowing. I have never slapped canola in a snowstorm before. It's uh, 10 p.m. They said it was going to snow, and they weren't kidding. The canola is starting to get, get white now. This is uh, this is my last pass. I'm going to have to quit. But if this keeps up, uh, the canola might be flat to the ground by morning. But uh, yeah, well, this is nuts. I've got a lot of canola to swath in too. And on top of that, it's supposed to freeze really hard. Like really hard. Minus eight. Uh, what's that in Fahrenheit? That's gotta be like 20, 20 something, I'm thinking. Yeah, it's gonna be 20 something. So that's a killer, heavy killing frost, boy. Some of this cola is still on the green side. So with a frost like that, it is done. Finished. But there is a lot of cola that's pretty ripe. So I don't know, whatever. Can't, uh, I can't cover it with a blanket. So maybe the snow will cover it and keep it warm. Insulation. Yeah, it is snowing. But like I said, this is a first for me. It doesn't even look like canola anymore. Starting to jam up on me here. I'm getting snow collecting on the header in the corners. I've got snow on top of it, so it's time to quit. Like I said, this is pretty nuts. I'm in the old swather, the 2320. The new, the painted one. So, uh, I brought this to the south farm. And I didn't have any time to bring the other one, so... I drowned it out spot here. And the canola looks weird because it's white. Yeah, that's uh... That's... It has snowed in September before. If I can I can't remember in my time, but it has. And uh, yeah, this is this is uh, like I said, this is creased. And there's a big washout here. That wasn't here in the spring. Must add a few downpours here or something to get that going like that. Anyway, I put the new LED lights on this thing and it sure makes a difference compared to the old uh, the old headlights on it. So it just makes it easier to see the snow. It's funny, this thing uh, is having a hot, like it puts out heat, but it must be pretty cold out there because I've had to turn it almost all the way up. So, yeah, I just thought I'd show everyone what farming is like in Northern Canada. Crap we have to go through. Yeah, well it's, this sucks. It's too early for this. All I can say is I hope it doesn't get as cold as they say it's gonna get. But to be, uh, for canola to be safe from freezing, it has to be cut at least three days before the heavy frost. And we're supposed to get like four days straight of uh, heavy frost. Anyway, I'm gonna head back to the truck. I'm going home. I'm done. 
I'm done for tonight, probably tomorrow, who knows? Or maybe for the rest of the year. Alright, thanks for watching. Take it easy. Well, that's it. I couldn't cut anymore. There's too much snow. It just uh, wouldn't wouldn't uh, flow through the paper header anymore. So I shut her down. As you can see, it's snowing pretty good. Uh, yeah. So I couldn't... Uh, I just didn't want to cut anymore. Too much snow. It was piling up on the knife and on the edge of the... of the header, so... The only thing is... Uh, Eh, whatever. <laughs> I'm so disgusted right now with this weather. Hey, it's building up on my boots. It's up. I just cut this grass. You can see how much snow was on it already. So just a couple hours ago. Yeah, it's, I think we skipped fall went right to Christmas. So I'm just waiting for the truck to warm up. Uh, Should have plugged it in. It was hard to start. Anyway, take my stuff. Yeah, that's that. That can stay. Take that. Turn. Oh, turn all my lights off. And that's that's it for that. I'm just uh, wondering what we'll uh, wake up to in the morning. The weather does say heavy snowfall warning in red, so we'll see. Anyway, I'm going home. Thanks for watching.